Hi everyone and welcome to Studio de Sol. My name is Lina and today's video is going to be another thrift store project and today I'm going to be remaking an old table. So the table that I found consists of two parts. It's a top flat part and then the bottom. I'm not going to use the top part. I'm going to create my own using the epoxy resin and I'm just going to change the color of the bottom. All of the supplies that I'm using today, I'm like usual gonna list down below in the description, so check it out. And don't forget to hit this red button, like this video, and let's get started. And first what I'm gonna do is sand the base and then apply the white acrylic paint and let it dry. And while I'm waiting for the paint to dry, um, I'm about to start the second part, the top for the table. And for that, I already kind of prepared the mold. So for that, I measured the table dimension. And using some, uh, a piece of wood from my garage, I just created a mold. And now I just need to seal it to avoid any kind of holes in there. And then we're gonna mix the resin. And I already prepared the mold. I sealed it as much as I could. I'm really scared about this part because I've seen a lot of um, table desk being failed because of like the resin was like just dripping out of the mold. And this is my first time trying to do the tabletop. Um, pretty pretty worried how it's gonna go but the next step what I'm gonna do now is just mix the resin and also I'm gonna add on this fake flowers uh, plants into the resin to maintain the same pattern in my bedroom which is like a rainforest so let's keep going and I just want to add a few words about the epoxy resin that I was using this time that's the new brand that I'm using it's called total boat and most of the resin have their own instructions how you need to mix it but this particular one i was mixing uh, equal parts of part a and equal part of the hotter of the part b
And this is day number three, guys. I let my tabletop sit for three days. Um, I applied, I cannot say how many times I mixed the resin, but I had two, I had two gallons in total. So this is two gallons, looks like. And now, the scariest part, we're gonna take it out of the mold. Oh, the moment of truth. Because <laughs> it might go wrong and might be okay. I even don't know what to start with. I think the easiest for me is to remove the sides. And I did it! Oh my god, it took quite an effort. But look at the result. Just a little stick left. This is how this looks like. I know it's not perfect, but it's my first tabletop ever. Would be nice maybe to make it a little bit thicker, add another few layers of frozen, but I don't have any and I checked if I ordered today. It would be another week to get the resin, so I think it's quite a good experiment for the first time. Let me know what you think. I hope I deserve the like for that effort. And now I'm just gonna go over the edges and see the imperfections cut it out. Uh, then I'm also gonna finish up decorating the bottom part of the table and then we're gonna pull it off together. This is the next step guys. So I applied three, uh, three layers of the acrylic paint. I kind of not satisfied with the result, but it's already too late. <laughs> I think it would be better and easier if I did the white spray paint because um, some of the base color is picking through and it's like mixing with the white creating this like little bit of a milky shade on a just bright white color. And now when I the paint is completely dry I'm just gonna add some touch-ups with the gold pen and then we're just gonna um, attach the our top or the tabletop. All right guys, and we all done. Here's my final result. Let me know in the comments below what you think about this project. I personally happy with how it came out. Uh, I was really worried to work with the resin, especially with this big amount of resin, because um, I saw a lot of videos when the 
the resin is leaking out and the stuff like that but mine came up pretty good I also polished it as much as I could <laughs> um, and for the first time I think it's a really great results thank you so much for watching don't forget to hit this red button to subscribe to my channel like this video and we see each other in the next one